our job was to replace uh, four sections of glass in the existing media pods. To get the club up to a premiership standard, we needed to replace that glass in one complete section of glass. Our challenge was not only to remove the existing glass, but also to then load a five metre section of glass across all of these seats and then lift up 10 metres off the platform that you can see into the background. We involved tubes who um, we've worked with in this exact same location. They provided us a scaffold that run completely along the top to the gantry, running up at that high level. So these guys were the perfect guys to bring in, um, to design, to structurally build and deliver on time. We included in-house designs uh, they're a, a, a quite an integral part of this project due to the fact that the, the load and capabilities of the scaffold were way beyond what a TG20 scaffold would be. So PJ Spillens, tube scaffold and in-house design uh, talked through the project, worked out what the requirements were, what would work, what wouldn't work. Uh, this had to be done through the, the off-season of the football club, so we couldn't affect their, their playing time. So once the lads started on site, they had a challenge of carrying all the equipment into the site, through the stadium, up through into the seating areas and along the stadium. The scaffold is 100 metres long. And I must say that Tubes delivered a perfect service. This, this structure it was so solid and exactly as planned and spoken about. So. I can't thank Tubes and their team enough for that side of things um, and also I can't thank my guys enough as well for when that lift happened and went in we couldn't have asked for that to go any smoother. A real real big team project that got delivered um, on time and very smooth, very safe and I think everyone's happy.